Welcome to my channel Dr. Munshi Nasser is skilled on how are you my dear learners. In this video I am going to talk about how to increase your citations. Remember my dear learners publication in a good journal is not the end of the story. You have to increase your citations. Without a good citations of your article you may not get a good job in academia. So it is very important to increase your citations. There are several way you can increase your citations organically and I am going to talk about how you naturally increase your citations of your article and I will share 5 important tips with you in this particular video. So without wasting any time let's get started. My dear learners in this perplexity AI I discussed that key strategies for increasing citations. I asked the perplexity AI to answer me what are the key strategies for increasing citations. And this particular AI told me that you need to consistent author name and there should be a collaborative research. Remember my dear learners if you are from India you need to collaborate with somebody somewhere else maybe USA, maybe Canada, maybe Australia, maybe Bangladesh any parts of the world you can collaborate. Collaborating with another researcher will enhance your citations immensely. Next it says optimization the keywords and titles. Remember my dear learners optimizing meaning that it is kind of a SEO system. When you have search engine optimization policy for using your keyword citations it is very important to choose what are the keywords people will search your article. Now I am going to share these two important points using my article. One of my recent article that I have published it says about the transfer pricing practices in multinational corporations and their effects on developing countries tax revenue a systematic literature review and in this particular article I use a very catchy title where I discuss about the transfer pricing and also a systematic literature review. In this particular case you can see that transfer pricing, multinational corporations, tax avoidance, compliance, tax management and policy options. I carefully choose the keywords in order to optimize my search to find out my article by the researchers to increase my citations. So choosing the right keywords for your article is very important. And in this article also you can see I collaborate with another researcher. Akash Karla is one of my friend who is from USA and I am working as a associate professor in Bangladesh. So we are both collaborating and therefore this particular article recently published but it has got a lot of citations. Okay. Now the next point here it says that publish in high impact factor journals. Very important point high impact factor journal usually gives you a open access option to other researchers to find your article and cite your article. Now in this case in my case I also publish in a very good journal where international trade policy politics and development it's an MREL Q2 publications and this is one of the best in this particular domain. Now the next one it says open access publication very important point. Some of the journals even if it is a high impact factor journal they do not allow researcher to open their article for the common people. They ask the subscription. So in order to find a common open access journal Scopus you need to go and find out the open access journal options from the Scopus. Here is one of the option open access Scopus journals list a list of open access Scopus journals for you to publish your manuscript. I am going to share this link so that you can find your open access Scopus index journal to submit your next article and once it is open access it is very easy to find other researchers your article in order to cite. If they can't download your article if they can't read your article how would they cite your article. So it is very important that you go for an open access. Next it says share your data. Very important point. Share your article data. Nowadays people look and search that is there any data available for the article associated with that so that they can replicate your research findings using their, your 
data share your data this is called the open access open science pla pla platform where osf home is giving you a very free open access option where you can share your data set osf is fantastic platform and you can see these are my data and corresponding article information i already share publicly when i submitted my article so use osf home when you can share your data if you have a data set please share even if it is a review article you have a bunch of downloaded article or the bib text information or zotero bib text or rix information or referencing information you can share that with the other prof other researchers and they can find out yes these are the research uh, articles you use in your research by getting your information from osf so it's very important to share your data the next one is present in the conference of course it is a good way to present things and it will enhance your visibility of your article and then utilize social media now one of the other important thing that i believe is that importance of using your article in social media so here there is a fantastic social media for the researcher is research gate kindly open your research gate account today so that you can easily share your article in the research gate to in order to find out that people will search and get your get your article get your information very easily now regarding that my dear learners i am using a new platform where currently i am offering two of my courses one is systematic review and meta analysis basic to advanced and this is basically i am going to talk about the meta analysis and systematic review and where i try to give you a full overview of meta analysis and systematic review with a hands on training with the example data and help you to write a research article based on systematic review and meta analysis the current charge of this course is $50 USD but I will share two demo classes so that if you feel like you are happy to take this course with me then you can join me so take two demo classes starting from Saturday coming Saturday and another course is statistical methodologies for research paper writing it is helping the people who are looking for different methodology and can't find a suitable methodology for their paper in order to write and publish in a scopus journal i'm going to help them with my resources and tools and at the same time i'm going to share other domains whoever in literature humanities i will help them about the qualitative studies as well so you can take this course to understand how you can write your methodology in order to write a research article for a scopus publication so come and join and please contact this here the whatsapp number and also the email address given in the video description box please point one of the last point that i'm going to talk about is the review paper consider review papers very important because there is a trick here that every single research paper is added a literature review section right in the literature review section everyone is going to cite some of the articles which are based on systematic literature review if you write a literature review based article obviously your paper will be cited every single article that is considered in your domain so it is very smart way to write several review paper systematic review paper that will be enhance your citation because people are going to use your paper as a citation in their article when they write any topic in your domain and in this case you can see this is a literature review article and recently in my google scholar if you look at the google scholar by year if you look at in recent year time you can see the last 2023 22 times this article cited overall my citation is 900 but 22 times single article transfer pricing the systematic review were cited as compared to other papers in recent time so you can see the review paper is very useful for getting your citations and increase your citations so write a review paper quickly okay and one last tip that there is a fantastic platform SciSpace, which is a commonly free at this moment there is a paid version you can go for paid version but there is a free option where you can convert your research pdf to video video and if you convert your research pdf to video and kind of like this 
for example then what will happen the the video will help you to get visibility of your article you can see this is a researcher who is now sharing his article using the research pdf to video option in SciSpace platform so you can use that fantastic way to increase your visibility in the research gate or maybe in your facebook maybe in your twitter or any other platform social media platform that will help you to increase your visibility of your article and obviously that will in enhance your citation as well so i believe with these tips i am pretty sure you are going to increase your citations very easily organically or naturally without taking any external paid help do not go to the paid help use my tips to increase your citations and i am already demonstrating one of my article how i increase my citations by putting the right keywords and writing a literature review based paper and don't forget to join me in these two courses these two exciting courses and the whatsapp number you can try to knock me and i will obviously come back to you and you can join my demo classes from saturday coming saturday so thank you so much my dear learners i hope this video is useful for you and i will see you in the next tutorial with exciting research information bye bye